On the issue of the sale and lease and uh, Pueblo lands, the city charter restricts the city council's ability to sell Pueblo lands unless there's a vote of the people to allow a sale. And charter section 219 limits the lease of Pueblo lands to 15 years or less. In 1949, the voters authorized the sale of Site 653, and the question is whether that ballot language authorizing a sale would include the lesser conveyance of a lease. Other ballot measures on that same ballot authorized both sale or lease, whereas this ballot item only stated sale. However, California court generally held that the sale includes the lesser right to lease, so a court would likely find that a lease over 15 years is allowed. However, that being said, it's highly likely that a sale or lease to Hillel would trigger another lawsuit against the city, and it might be wise for the city council to consider inserting language if, they were to, if you were to approve tonight a sale or lease um, requiring Hillel to defend and indemnify the city from lawsuits r arising from the execution of either the sale or the lease contract. As far as the EIR situation, it was the recommendation of the city attorney's office that an EIR be prepared, and let me address that more clearly. Development services identified parking issues and traffic concerns associated with this project. At the time that this project went forward to the Planning Commission, there was no shared parking agreement in place. And in the absence of a shared parking agreement, our office opined that it would be necessary to go forward with an EIR or to not go forward at all. In, now that there is an, a shared parking agreement, it now turns to the city council to decide whether or not that agreement adequately mitigates any parking and or traffic concerns that you might have. The city attorney has not weighed in as to the sufficiency of that parking plan. But you're not suggesting an EIR is required at this time? We are not suggesting it's required, and we're not saying that the parking plan is adequate or inadequate. We're leaving that to your discretion. Thank you.